Video is absolutely insane. Thousands of people waiting in lines all across the country for a pretty impressive promotion at Build-A-Bear. Unfortunately, the store didn't expect the crowds that it got and things didn't end the way it hoped. Here's two on your side's Emily Lampa. It looked a lot like Black Friday, but really it was more like Bear Thursday. I want to sleep in it with it in my bed. Shoppers, thousands of them stuffing malls all across America for Build-A-Bear's pay your age deal. It was been almost four hours. This was the line. It wrapped all the way around the entire mall. Lines wrapping around stores and shopping centers from Phoenix to Charlotte, Washington State to Georgia. After a couple of hundred people and a couple hundred people more and a couple hundred people more, we, we queued it outside and now we have about a thousand people in line. Buffalo had its fair share of people bearing a long line to try and get into the Build-A-Bear store at the Walden Galleria. It's crazy. It's a mob scene. It's horrible. Fights breaking out inside the store with little kids. It's just a mob scene. Only to be disappointed when Build-A-Bear Corporate decided to shut down the promotion. They didn't have pylons up. They had no organization. They had nobody in control of the lines. They were definitely not prepared. Police from at least six different agencies had to be called in when the decision was made. Did you have anybody available to send us to the mall? We're going to temporarily close down the store and they're handing out vouchers, but people aren't happy with that. We just need to keep the peace here. There's a lot of people who are not happy. Bill DeBear released a statement which said the response was, quote, overwhelming. Continuing, we understand that many guests were turned away due to safety concerns created by the crowds and unfortunately given these circumstances we were unable to serve all of our guests for the pay your age day event as planned. The company said it would also make vouchers available to its bonus club members. Emily Lampa, Channel 2 News.